Hi, this is Shoto and welcome to my YouTube channel. So, this video is going to be a little different. After I started my spiritual journey, this is the first time ever I thought of investing in a Rudraksh Mala, which is a very common thing worn by spiritual people. First, I was really skeptical about getting one because I was afraid of being judged by people around me. Maybe they will like freak out if they see me wearing a weird Rudraksh Mala, which is like a symbol of Sadhu Sanyasi. But uh, something happened in my life. There were some changes and I also had to shift to another room and i was procrastinating a lot and i was thinking like something is wrong going on in my life and i should get a rudraksh mahala for myself this product was introduced to us during the inner engineering session by isha foundation okay so if you do not know uh, isha foundation is Sadhguru's foundation which is completely run by volunteers even after i did my inner engineering i can any time go and volunteer there maybe i would like to share my experience there in a future video but yes also i would like to clarify Sadhguru is not the only spiritual guru i follow i follow a lot of sources but yes Sadhguru's program is something that like i genuinely felt like i should attend and yes it changed my life in a drastic way so what i was saying yeah so recently i have been procrastinating a lot a lot mean for two days and that time i spoke to a very good friend of mine who has also done his inner engineering and he helped me he said yeah you should definitely get one because like when there's a lot of change in our life we cannot like focus on our spiritual practices and like our day-to-day -day energy shift so that is something rudra helps us stay connected to the higher power <laughs> i don't know the exact word maybe like to maintain a positive energy around us i ordered this rudraksh mala from isha shop and it took me like three days yeah i got it within three days so it came in a cardboard box like this as you can see you can see uh, the recent campaign which is like Kaveri calling going on so I'm gonna put the link in the description so after I receive this I cannot just wear it as it is also as you can see the mala is quite orangish looking to condition it I kept it in pure ghee for 24 hours first then the next day I take it out and washed it with water I don't know if I did something wrong maybe I, I shouldn't have washed it with water and put directly put it in the milk but anyway i just washed it with plain water and put it in a full fat milk and trust me guys handling he was a real task it was like really messy so i forgot to film it when i put it in the milk so now as you can see it's almost like curd like it's after it's soaked in milk for 24 hours now all i have to do is take it out and wash it in plain water we are supposed to clean it with the plain white cotton fabric i did not have any cotton fabric i just used this cotton pouch that came with the mala and it worked perfectly okay so here comes a big moment let's see <laughs> Uh, it's quite dry now and as you can see the beads are pretty small like this much it's like my shoulder length and let's see what happens after wearing it <laughs> I was kidding it's just it's just the mala but yeah I'm not liking this tassel part I think I'm gonna cut it short mm, yeah i'm gonna cut it short by the way that was a joke guys but seriously did you notice i was actually wearing this mala during the whole video so this is it as you can see as the mala is pretty small i think i'll be able to wear it every time if i wanted i would like to say if you think this step was a little too much i don't think it has a really magical power or anything uh or maybe it has i don't know it might just work as a placebo effect you know what placebo effect right you should google it 
but even if it is i'm happy with it if i'm like feeling good wearing it i am going to be by the way about the pricing and all i would like to say i am wearing this it's a 6 mm rudraksh mala uh with shipping and all it cost me about 1299 which is like around Eighteen dollars, and if you're on a budget, you can get the eight millimeter one, which will be a bigger size, but it comes for three hundred rupees. I took it as a birthday gift of mine because next month is my birthday, so I thought I should like gift myself something meaningful, not just a shallow dress or something. So that's it. I thought of getting the smaller one and like spending a little more. I'm feeling great. I'm feeling great. It's still. So it's like ghee a little bit. I think I can tolerate it for two days. And also, I would like to say, if you are also into spirituality and would like to have a Rudraksh mala for yourself, it would be better if you don't get it from a local source or just from a local shop. You know, because they sell fake Rudraksh mala. And I know someone personally, a friend of mine who. came to india and just got a fake rudraksh mala from varanasi for like 100 rupees and trust me he started feeling some not so good vibe after getting that and he just had to throw it away i'm going to put the link of isha shop in my description if you are interested you can just go through their website and just read about it it would be helpful and yeah that's it i hope you like this video give it a thumbs up a thumbs down whatever you like and please subscribe if you would like to know more about my life changing experience after spiritual awakening and other stuff i keep sharing about life and everything and bye